Hey folks, Greeters here, and let's get back to playing a little Imperion Galactic Survival. Uh, as you can see, I'm in the hold, the uh, back section of the Adiana. <clears throat> and right outside is uh, the Promethium Rock. I have left the Ilmarinen for reasons. We're going to go back to it in this episode and probably die a lot. And I'll be honest, I actually started this episode already and forgot to hit the record button. Or I hit it twice or something. I thought I hit it. And, and I don't know what happened. Anyway. So, uh, but I want to make a run back to the base right quick. Because in the last... I How to say this and sound coherent at the same time. It's difficult. <laughs> it's really tough to do. Uh, in between episodes, I changed my armor from the mini armor that I had on. And right now I have a heavy armor on. Uh, because the Il Marinin is just going to be a nightmare, and I am going to die frequently. And I de determined during that time, I was just like, "Oh, I'll just hop on the Adiana. I got an armor locker on there," and found out I don't have an armor locker on here. <laughs> there's, there's not one anywhere on here, and I could put one on top of that oxygen station right there, uh, which probably makes sense, or maybe on top of one of the CPU extenders, which should also be fine. So we are going to do that, but since the uh, Promethium is right here, um, if it'll show up, uh, oh, let's just do this and do this, and it's right outside here. And so we're gonna we're gonna pop the drone. What? Why? Oh, I can't move. All right. Uh, I, okay, I like the jetpack thing. That it provide some ambient light, but at the same time, sometimes I hate it. <laughs> right, do we, are we connected to this thing? We're not. All right. So I'm going to do a little bit of space drilling here. And the reason why I'm I'm doing it by drone and not by person is because that heavy armor does not have an EVA boost on here. So I would get freezing really quick. This looks vastly different than what it used to. Ooh, that was weird. All right. Well, we're going to mine a little bit because we do need some Promethium. We are severely lacking it, and uh, we need to be able to produce our own fuel and stuff. I should have parked a little bit closer, but it's fine. We'll figure it out. Uh, and then when I get back to the uh, Il Marinin or I find something else more interesting, I'll bring you all back, because you don't want to watch me drone mine here in Asteroid for a little bit of Promethium. So, we'll see in a second. Ah, ready. We're back. <laughs> I did put an armor locker on the Adiana, as mentioned, and even colorized it. There it is. Now it has an armor locker. Uh, and um, just so you know, when the Adiana was first built, armor lockers were not allowed on SVs. And some time ago, they changed that. So now they are. And I always forget to save a blueprint that has the armor locker on it. In fact, I ought to save this blueprint that has the whole shield on it. Uh, the two extra generators, the CPU extenders, the rockets. In fact, I'll wait until I get the homing rockets, and then I'll do that. And the armor locker. But we should be good to go. I also picked up some extra stuff. Oh, dag nabbit. I forgot to put the Promethium away. <clears throat> and that's taking up half our storage. Oh, no. Uh, son of a gun. I am just brilliant. And I picked up some extra health packs that we had at the uh, base and some extra bandages because <laughs> I'm going to need them. <sighs> Alright, so there's that. And let's get in here and get things done. Alright, so I already flipped a switch and a bunch of stuff blew up over here. And how I switched the armor in the first place was this thing had a repair station, so I fixed up the medium armor, I think, and uh, changed out with the uh, armor locker that is on here and stuck the heavy armor on, which has a jetpack boost, a multi-boost, a multi-boost, and a multi-boost, as, as you can see down in the slots one, two, three, four, down near the bottom of the screen there, uh, next to the hot bar. So we do have heavy armor on, which has an armor of 200. Uh, current durability is maxed out. Uh, that's not maximum durability, which is 800, so I've repaired it once already. Um, so that's fine. And uh, now we got a 
I think I flipped this switch already too. Yes, because this is now unlocked. And we're going to go downstairs and die. Mm hmm. It'll be lots of fun. <laughs> so let's just finally get this on the road. Uh, let's get busy. There's a console we can talk to. It's emergency console. Let's talk to it. Emergency console. Computer system is in safe mode. Please, pr bleh, please press any key to review automatically generated logs. Press any key. Log one. Hazardous substance warning issued in container unit three. And then two through six is going to be radiation levels in container unit three are elevated. Uh, not good. Foreign biological material detected in cargo conduits. Uh-oh, it's spreading. Uh, and then detected in cargo units one and five. Well, it's spreading pretty fast. And one, three, and five would be on the same side of the ship. And I think the odd numbers are on one side. The even numbers are on the other side uh, from where the Adiana is parked outside. And then we got more biological material detected in... Uh, excuse me. Unit seven, six, and... Oh, boy. Cargo corridor. I got the hiccups. I need a little sip of something. And then detect it in the ventilation system. Oh, they're doomed. And once they get in the ventilation system, that's it. It's all over with. Just, uh, you know, take a walk outside in the cold, dark space. It'll be faster and less painful. And then you won't have to worry about me coming trying to kill you after you've turned into a legacy thing. Uh, that's breach containment. Oh, boy. Crew ordered to quarters. Quarantine now in effect. Qu quarantine now in effect. Unknown life forms detected aboard. Oh, boy. That's never good. Ship, and I think the unknown life forms must be the crew that got... What's the word I'm looking for? Evolved? Maybe? Devolved? Probably. Better apt description uh ship is under full lockdown under executive order 124 condition red crew members aboard zero mm, all be dead lower power de low power detected if i can pronunciate correctly which is going to be difficult entering silent mode and then log 217 emergency console activated unregistered personnel that would be me, I presume. Uh, then we got a sign here. Bio, bleh, biohazard containment. Super freighter Ilmarinen is under enforced quarantine due to hostile biocontaminants. Blast doors require two-man authorization. Both manual overrides must be pulled. Authorized Polaris personnel only. Well, I mean, if it's authorized Polaris personnel only. Okay, fine. I just... We, what? We just leave. Let's go find some Polaris and make them deal with this mess, huh? That sounds like good ideas to me. I don't want to deal with this. Let's go find some Polaris and let them deal with it. Yeah, that's not going to work. <laughs> Unfortunately, that would be a fabulous option if I could. But you can't. So I'm going to pull a switch and stupidly pull another switch. All right. Let's go. The ship is under full lockdown, but we need to go to the bridge and access the captain's logs. Behind the blast doors, there is a corridor on the left with a... Hush! Phone. With a staircase that would lead to the topmost level of the vessel with the bridge. All right. And uh, that would be this corridor, I presume. That's locked. Uh, nice little cafeteria here. Oh, hi. A hamburger! Oh, we're hungry. Let's have it. Uh, they look very comfortable and satisfied for the moment. It's not going to last long, is it? Well, I saw that. I saw that. <laughs> well, I survived the first turret. I wonder how long that's going to last. And I may go quiet during part of this uh, because just I really don't want to die. Uh, we are on level three we need to get to level seven well that didn't take long four five can't go in six looks like a restroom anything nothing anything nothing ah. all other factions can't open those well it is under lockdown oh uh-oh Something's talking to us, whispering. 
Is that this name? What are you doing here? Who's there? Join, leave, or... Hey, 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 hey. Ida, did you track that voice? My sensors did not track any voices or sounds other than metallic noises of steel, possibly the four... Please wait. Attention, I am detecting movement on this level. I am absolutely sure that this was not there a moment ago. Yeah, <laughs> I got a really bad feeling about this. All right. You're going to have to deal with stuff. Ah, oh, hi. What do you got? Laser pistol. We'll just toss this crap in the Adiana right away. Hopefully this will stay in, in uh, wireless range. I keep wanting to say Wi-Fi range, which is basically the same thing. Uh, so we'll toss that in there. Of course we need that. Uh, there is a turret there, but I can't shoot it through the holes for reasons. Well, it could probably shoot me through the holes too. So eh, works both ways, I guess. All right. That's closed. 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 Oh. No. Hello? Anybody home? I can't open the door. Oh, there is somebody there. Can you poke your something through the door so I can shoot it? No. Uh, it'd be nice if they cooperated like that. Oh, oh boy. No, no. Oh, man. Th those things hurt. And it, that's just right in direct line. I just, there's no way around it. I am just going to get shot. Can't avoid that one. All right. Bandage up a little bit. You know what I need? You know... Mm. Hmm. Can I... Is that a thing I can do? I'm thinking out loud. Well, I'm thinking to myself and kind of out loud, although I'm not expressing what I'm thinking very... Accurately, or at all, I'm just saying that I'm thinking. Smoke is coming out my ears. Level three. So what I'm thinking is maybe up here. Hmm. Where would I put it? Huh. I'm not sure a good place to put this thing. Maybe, like over here? Because I'm pretty sure we're going to go through these doors at some point, and it'd be great if it was kind of located in a safe place, but yet it would fit here. All right, here's what I'm thinking. This thing is a factory. We got 18 minutes, 18 real-time minutes left. Uh, and I don't want to abort it because it takes two hours. <laughs> um, son of a. What I'm thinking is is bringing in the um, the uh, EM pillbox. One of the versions. There is a new version now, the EM pillbox two. The first one is clad in uh heavy armor blocks. So it requires some titanium. Uh, in some comments, I said satium and later corrected it to titanium. I'm not sure why. Uh, but that, the titanium rods is required because it, uh, every all the blocks surrounding all the vital components are heavy armor. The EM pillbox 2, you might notice, does not require any titanium and even less amount of materials because it's clad in regular steel blocks, not heavy steel armored blocks um so there are two versions now for those that may want it if you're going to put it in a hostile poi and it possibly could get shot a few times this will take more uh damage than this one will and the core is kind of it's actually located right behind the uh, clone chamber which doesn't have a whole lot of hit points i should bury it a little further deeper in there but it's fine I think, but right now I can't do anything because um, the ship is being built. And we got a little over 15 minutes of that real time. Or is that game? I think that's game time. That's Yeah, that was game time, I think. I don't know. I don't know things anymore. Maybe it was real time. Let's have a look. 
No, I think that's real time. Great. All right, level six. We want level seven uh, because things want to kill us. If I hmm, can I? Oh boy! Run away! It's not going to damage the blocks, but did it kill the thing? That's what I want to know. No, still alive over there. How about this one? He was closer to the door. How about you? <laughs> can I can I cheat a little bit? Maybe. Game, let me cheat a little bit. See, it's not damaging these because there's an admin gore on this thing, and they're not already damaged. So there's nothing I can do to hurt them, unfortunately. How about how about this one? We'll just plant a few. Why not? It's not gonna hurt anything. Too bad I can't remote explode those. That'd be great. I am hoping the blast will get something behind these doors. Probably not, huh? It's just best wishes, isn't it? Oh! I already got that. Okay. Almost forgot about it. Oh, hello. There's another one. Ah. Alright. What do we got in here? Meds. Lovely. Probably much required meds. Ooh, those will go right in our pockets. Lovely. Lovely. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Great. Uh, well, we'll have it. It's fine. All right. Can't talk to that console. There is a switch. Nope. Nope. Refrain from flipping the switch. Oh. <laughs> what the? That's new. Huh. And that looks an awful lot like the... Oh, there's another one. Okay. Like this planet right here that we're in orbit of. Oh, we can see the Adiana down there. Ida's talking to us. I'm ignoring her because she talks a lot of nonsense sometimes. Uh, we got to review this console over here and check out some logs and stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so there's one, three, five, and seven's gone, and then two, four, six, which is gone, and eight that's gone. In fact, I think seven is like hanging off the side there. But there's the that looks a lot like this planet right here. I'm more interested in this thing. <laughs> now, huh? If we put one of these on our ship, will it do the same thing? Would it, would it show the planet that we are in the system of? Huh. I'm intrigued. <laughs> Seriously, I'm intrigued. I want to know these things. I am more interested in this than, well, dying multitudes of times in this ill-fated, ill marinant All right, here we go. Access the console. Acting Captain's Log 2217-5301. Something in the cargo we were carrying has breached containment and has been infecting both the ship and the crew. It started as nothing more than a few headaches, but before long it had spread to the entire crew. Slowly they became delusional and had to be locked in their own quarters before they became violent. Whatever it was in the cargo we were carrying, it's been hard at work while we've been trying to contain the crew. Slowly. But surely, it consumed and disabled the cargo sensors and began corrupting the hull of the ship unnoticed. At least until I looked out the window and saw gross on the exterior of Unit 5. I had to. Order cargo purges on the remaining units that I could still access. I'm about to initiate a complete lockdown of all systems and shut all emergency bulkheads and blast doors before I... I... I've slaved the controls away from the ship's AI to a lever here on the bridge. I've put some security turrets in here to keep those things, those things, ugh, away from the controls. I think I'll uh, take a little walk outside. It's a lovely day. I might as well enjoy it.
Does that mean that there's a body outside? Oh, I'm interested in that. Uh, okay, so all the logs should be stored in the main core control. To open the doors, we need to deactivate the containment system. Ida, why do you always suggest the stupidest things? There's a lockdown override switch near the entry of the bridge. Yeah, right, right, right over there. That, that's the kill crater switch. <laughs> Unleashes all the things aboard the ship to come and kill the craters. Uh, no, no, see, we got to follow what Ida tells us to progress in the story. Oh, this is a lovely view. Oh, I can crawl up the window. Ain't that nice? Um, yeah. Over at the control station, wherever that was at, uh, that ish way, somewhere over there ish, uh, the, the log told us to blow the ship to smithereens and turn it into spaced dust. Did we listen? No. Now, Ida wants us to flip a switch that unleashes hell upon the craters to uh, undo the lockdown that is currently undergoing on the ship. So this will basically open all the doors. Nice place for the detector, by the way. Uh, and open all the doors for all the mean, nasty, ugly things that are screaming at us downstairs and um, let them out to come and kill me. Ida. Ida. Ida is trying to kill me. Ida is trying to kill me. I should kill Ida first. Oh, darn it. I unleashed the uh, thruster sounds. Is that for my jetpack? No, that's not for my jetpack. All right. While the doors are still locked down, apparently this is a bug. I don't know if it's been reported or not, but if I go away and come back, it should fix it. So what I am doing is going back to level three where there is a teleporter that I can make use of right quick because that's just going to drive me mad. There shouldn't be these thruster sounds. Thrusters are off on the Adiana. There are thrusters out here, but they should not be making noise. But that was a switch. <laughs> Can I blow it up from here? That would be nice. Excuse me. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna head over to the uh, control station right quick. See if we can fix this thruster thing. Thruster sound thing. Somebody should report that to Elion if it already hasn't been reported. They have been. I don't really know. And not that one. Was it over here? There was a screen somewhere on here. Well, I don't know why I checked that. I knew I got that already. That had a dude's name on it. And I think that is the dude that is responsible for the current state of the Omerinen. Uh, build, build. Build. I mean, not, not the legacy thing. Oh, I'm cold. If I turn that off? No, that didn't do it. Okay. Uh, I swear there was one... Listed him. I'll, I'll have to go watch the last episode myself and find. Oh, we got to take the uh, teleporter because we're freezing to death. Because we don't have the deep space module on our armor, the heavy armor, whatever that thing is called that I forgot already. I should know these things, but I don't. All right. Uh, thruster sounds are off. Okay, back, back to uh, dying. <sighs> Hopefully, it will kill a few things. Now, I, I think I mentioned earlier, I, I may go a bit quiet during this because I am going to be concentrating on not dying, uh, which is going to take a bit of brain power, and I don't have a whole lot of it to begin with. So, <laughs> yeah. All right. Here we go. Uh, and if I go quiet for too long, I'll just add some music into the into the edit or something and i may shorten this by skipping some stuff uh we will loot at the end mostly um we're gonna loot a bit as we go until i can get the uh did i oh six minutes maybe i can blather on about a lot of nonsense for seven minutes i can do that i'm perfectly capable of that yes i'm gonna bring the the pillbox in and plant it somewhere that's that's what i i did mention that right i think so sure <laughs> I'm going to plant that somewhere down because it has a clone chamber on it. 
that's mostly why I want it. So we can actually bring in the cheap one as long as we put it someplace safe. And that is not the thing for it. It should be this one with a little two up in here. Um, I use the same image for it, but that's fine. Whatever. Oh, I didn't update my blueprints from my laptop. That's what it is. I got you. And it didn't download. Okay. No, no issues there. All right. That explains that. Uh, what else can I blather on for several minutes? Well, we could just take a break and I can stare out the window. It's a lovely day for a walk. What door did this guy go out? Can we find a body outside the door? If he took a walk outside, I'm assuming he went through here and went through there. And I think I know where that door is. So if we come down here, none of, none, security protocol is still in place. And curiosity has me curious. <clears throat> uh, that, yeah, sounded dumb. It's fine. <laughs> All right. I'm going to drone it here as far as I can go. If I can uh, stay in, stay in. There we go. Now, this would be immersion if we could come out that back door and find a guy, a body floating out here in space. Like somewhere in this general area. Because I assume he, that's the door. That is the door right there. Because we are standing just on the other side of, well, downstairs. Just on the other side of that door right there. And that is it. I don't know what these things are. Oh, fuel pods of some sort? I gotcha. Half blown up. And I guess there were a couple more here. Because some damage has been... Taken. Aboard the ship. No bodies. I'm disappointed. Space engineers, you could do a thing like that. They have bodies. That you can plant. It's really kind of cool. But Empyrean is not space engineers. And space engineers is not Empyrean. Empyrean is, well, my best description is what I tell people all the time. It's Minecraft in space, sort of. It has a plot. It has a story that you're following. That we're following, actually, right now, as I talk a lot about nonsense right now. Uh, space engineers does not have a story at all. And uh, so you got to kind of make up your own. Is this a door to someplace? It is not. Bummer. Okay, well, that answers that. All right. How much time did I kill doing that? Probably a lot of episode time. Uh, we are at 40 minutes. Uh, minus, minus 12 minutes for uh, running back to the basin and forgetting to put the thing in there. How much time do we have left? Factory? Is it done? Four minutes. Three and a half minutes. All right. We'll be all right back. Okay. Haven't flipped a switch yet. <laughs> but, uh, it's been a few minutes. It's longer than a few minutes. Because um, I had to wait for the uh, ship to get done. Which, now that is ready. Fabulous. Unlock level 10. This, this would be a nice ship. I can't wait to check it out. I have not seen it up close and personal. Like, uh, And then I had to wait another seven minutes for this thing. We had just enough copper... And barely enough silicone to get this thing done. So, but we're going to spawn it in. Hopefully we can do that. Ah, oh. I was thinking here on the bridge would be a good spot. Um, maybe not. Can I stick it on? Oh, <laughs> there, there was a sneaky little spot over here. I can put it. Like right there. Sure. Oh, close the thingy. Uh, do I got any fuel? Or did I put it all in the Adiana? Uh, wrong buttons were pushed. Uh, darn it. Oh, but we might be able to make some. What's it take to make fuel? We have a... Uh, we need... Open! Oh, we need some fuel, don't we? Oh. Well, that's just weird. How can I can't access the stuff? Aha! Aha! No! Oh, it's being weird. There's the clone chamber. I, I don't... It's being slightly strange. I can't access the things. 
like the health thingy. Oh, come on. <laughs> All right, if we find some fuel, I will put... I was trying to... I was hoping to access a constructor, but it's not... I, things are being weird. All right, fine. Uh, I'm going to reload the game. Maybe, maybe that'll help. Hold on, be right back again. So sorry. Oh, and the thruster sounds are back. Fabulous. All right, well, we know the trick to fix that, and... Ah, there we go. Reloading did help. All right, so we got... Our medic station. We have our constructor. Can we use the constructor? It doesn't have any power. Uh, fuel. Can we make any fuel? Um, which would be here? Here. Here. Yes. Promethium pellets. We just need some promethium. <laughs> oh, no. Thank you. Uh, we don't need all of it. We'll just take, like, I don't know. 30? Should be more than enough. Uh, pillbox. Throw that in there. Access the constructor. There we go. Can we make some... Oh, can. It's like five. That's all we need. Nope. Oh! We need power to make the power stuff. <laughs> Fine, we'll leave that in there. All right, but we still have... Uh, we'll find some, I'm sure, somewhere to get that thing going. Oh, my word. The thruster sounds are back. Hold on. I'll be right back again. I'm going to run back to the teleporter. All right, we're back. All right, let's flip the switch and die. Uh, whispering. Uh, you've made your choice. Be welcome like all the other... Lower being searching for freedom. Be joyful. <laughs> what? What choice? Who's speaking? I am fulfillment. I am ascendancy. I am everything. I am... Hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. What happened to the crew of this vessel? Tell me that. No worries about them, lower beings. You will follow your kindreds to the higher spheres leaving your tangible bodies behind hang on a second so you killed them i don't know if it's hard to hard to do that uh why so dismissive lower being everything is all right i don't think so friend well enemy thing i will find out what you did and who you are <sighs> I am confused, Lower Being. What do you mean? I'll make sure you are not posing any danger for anyone anymore. <sighs> I am afraid I cannot allow, cannot allow that. Welcome my children and be defeated. Well, we'll see about that. <laughs> Strong words from a person who's about to die. Commander, Ida says, I am tracking a lot of movement all of a sudden. We need to find a way to the core and destroy this ship, if we can. I, I, Ida. Uh, oh, God. We, we were told to destroy it. Now you finally want to destroy it. After we're on board and unleashed all the deadly things from the lockdown. Now. Now you want to destroy the ship. Oh, my God. All right, so we gotta go downstairs, back to main, level five, and find the main control deck. We are so going to die. Can I crouch, please? Thank you. I'm not sure which way I want to go. I know there's creatures down here. There's creatures on the other side, down the other stairway. I don't want to go to either one, to be honest with you. I want to escape. I want to go out the doors and just go away. Leave the Polaris to this mess. Because I don't want to deal with it. Hi. Oh, crap. And I am stuck in a corner. Oh, God, there's three of them. All right. Run, 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 run. Oh, uh, I was going to say, I'm going to die. <laughs> Uh, an abomination killed me. Lovely. Well, 
<laughs> this is why I've wasted so much time during this episode. We don't have a whole lot of time left. Probably another 15-ish minutes. But we can respawn at the EM pillbox and get our stuff back, hopefully somewhat safely. Launch the drone while I uh, can, sort of. There we go. And let's go get our crap, which is right at the bottom of the stairs here. Or not even at the bottom. There we go. Okay. All right. We are fully flipped around. Wonderful. All right. Let's see if we can go die some more. Uh, maybe I ought to put a kill counter up in the corner of the screen because this is going to happen a lot. I don't want this thing. Oh, reload. Reload before we get in more trouble. I don't know where they went. Did they go back to their bedrooms? That's what I want to know. I think we killed one. <laughs> Uh, one is the loneliest number. Oh, we got two, at least. Ooh, I'll have that crap, sure. We are so gonna die some more. Where'd they go? They're probably gonna creep up behind me and then kill me. All right, here we go. Oh, come on, right when I'm reloading. Oh. 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 <laughs> that did not take long at all. Elion has done something to this game in 1.9. And we started this in 1.7, I think, this series. Maybe there's something wrong with my save, which is why we are dying so easily, or they have nerfed everything so badly that it's just easier to die. And I got things set on um, normal difficulty. It's not difficult. Uh, it's not easy. Can I, can I, if I do this and then do that, maybe I can stand up straight. No, I can't. Yet. All right, but that's fine. Let's go get our backpack again. So that's what, three, two? I don't even know. Uh, which was where? Aha. Uh -huh. All right. Oh, I'm still crouched. Okay. Fabulous. Reload. This is just terrible. Oh. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, where'd you come from? Okay. 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 Damn legacy. These abominations are a real pain in the rear end. All right. No more in here. We searched that already. Do we have to use the toilet? Uh, not right at the moment. We better have a bandage. Because we got... See, we we get hurt, so it's like the armor does nothing. <laughs> it's, maybe that's what's going on. The armor's actually doing nothing, but it's getting damaged regardless. Um, that's... I, I swear that... Oh, hey, hey, hey. No, none of that, sir. More of that. Okay. Anything in here? No. Anything more in here? I did I I did not get a chance to loot the dead corpse here. Dang damn it. Okay. There's a thing in here. I will have that. Thank you. Oh. A sandwich. Oh. Oh boy. There's two of them. Oh, come on. I mean, I swear, they, they stretch their neck from raid way down at the end of the hall and, and get you no matter what. I hate those things. They're so unfair. They didn't used to be able to stretch their necks like that. Now it's just... Did I get him? I did. Okay. All right, let's go down the other side. We got to go down, but I think... A couple of those abominations came through here. Oh, there's a turret. Oh, that was that turret we were seeing through there. Yes, hi. One's down. No, no, don't, don't touch me. And it takes so long to reload anything. It's stupendous. Lovely game, Elyon. Lovely. Just love to hate this game. Hate to love this game, which I do. I, I really do like this game, but I can still complain about it a lot. 
equipment, more bandages, because we need that. Uh, mini gun rounds. Exactly what I don't need. Oh, I don't know why I'm putting stuff in here. Take, I don't need that. Uh, we'll hang on to that. We'll eat that. Thank you. Uh, Adiana, we'll drop this stuff in here until it's full, and then we'll use the pillbox. Okay. I got plants. Plants. <sighs> And about 10 minutes left in this recording. So we're going to have to break this episode up. Because mm. I wasted a lot of time. Jetpack boost. Lovely. Oh! Oh! oh. Where'd he come from? <laughs> I'm busy looting. Oh, tier two. Oh, I'm surprised he didn't kill me with like three shots. That's what it feels like. All right. That's this side. We can't go through here because, well, reasons. Actually, we could. We could. We got to make use more um, words. Words I'm looking for. We got to make better use of the jetpack, and maybe we won't die so much. That that would be smart. Oh, what do we got here? Laser rifle. I have no laser rifle cells. None. All right, that's good. Okay. Ooh, a shower. All right. All right, so we are going downstairs. I don't want to go downstairs. Oh, there's another. Oh, hello. Uh, assault shotgun. We don't need that. Got it. Oh, we do have an assault shotgun. That's what this thing is, right? It's loaded. This thing's loaded. And the other two I don't really care about. Okay. Well, I got quiet all of a sudden, which is never a good sign. All right. Um... Oh, sausages. We'll have a couple of those. Okay. Do I got any food on here? Oh! Wrong thing. Uh, have that. Okay. I thought he might have trouble at that door, but I was so wrong. <laughs> he still didn't hit me, though, somehow. Another shower. Oh, I might as well use the restroom. Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Okay. Oh, felt good, though. <laughs> Probably needed to check my pants after that. Anyway, all right. Um, And that, I don't think we can open. Nope, other faction. All right. Level five. Uh, we need to go further down to the freight deck. To get there, we need to activate the freight elevator. The switch is in the cargo bay, too, but the way is blocked. We need to find the system status console on the main control deck. Which is where? This one? I guess. Oh, I don't like the sound. <gasps> Hi. Uh, did he die? He did. Stand still. I'm going in here. <sighs> what are those? LS charge BAs. Oh, those are for the big guns on a, a CV. Okay. That's what that is. We don't have that yet. Oh, no. Where'd he go? Get out of the... <sighs> where, where the crap was that? Hmm. Uh, fridge. 
cargo. I'm going to check something. Yes, okay. It's got the right version. <laughs> It'd suck if I had the wrong version <laughs> of my own blueprint. Uh, I find that funny for reasons. Okay. Boots! Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Oh, put that on us. In our own pockets. Thank you. All right, go back to Aviana. Uh, that's a first. That is special. There's actually armor in an armor locker. It's medium armor, but still. Huh? Oh, armor boost. Oh, ho, 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 ho. okay. What do we got? Pulse rifle. Okay. And a minigun. Never liked the minigun. I should try it again. Maybe maybe I'll like it now. Probably not. Would probably be the answer to that. I am. Well, I'm full health. Oh boy. There's a window there. Oh, hello. Come and get me. All right, you be dead. Where was the thing that was shooting at me? That's what I don't understand. Oh, God. a full magazine. I was getting shot in here by a turret. Did I destroy the turret? Oh, I see you. Aha! Aha! Okay, takes care of that. Still full health. Really? <laughs> How'd that happen? Oh! No! Oh. Okay. Now I'm half health. He hit me like twice. <laughs> Swear to... Uh... <sighs> Heavy armor. With multi-boosts on it. I should put that armor boost on here. But these have an armor boost of 15. 15 and 15. That's 45, and then this doesn't help anything. But uh, And then it, this has got an armor of 200. So I should have 245 armor. And a guy hits me, and it takes half my health away with, like, two measly shots. Hi, can you come out and play? Thank you. And die. No, no, none of that. Oh, great. And I'm stuck. I can't move. Oh, I'm I'm about to die. Take uh, that, that. Come on, stupid game. I I still got stuff going on. Uh oh. I should take it. No, that didn't take care of that. What do I need? A first aid kit. Uh, I think I have that. Let's get back to semi full health. Well, uh, no, that's that's. Not an issue. I brought a first aid. That's a. I just took a detox. Well, that's fine. It probably helped. First aid kit. Okay. Whew. Throw that on there. Throw those on there. All right. Back to full health. Haven't died recently. Surprisingly, I get this guy loot him before it goes away, and I'm probably gonna get shot. All right. What do we got? Uh, we got to wrap it up here shortly. It's quiet all of a sudden. Oh, thank you very much. I need all of that. Uh, oh, God, no. Where'd you come from? You dropped on my head from, oh. That is not fair. Not fair at all. At least it was a scorpion. Ah, another detox kit. Well, that's fine. That's fine. I prefer a first aid kit, but yeah, I know. Beggars can't be choosers at this point in time. And I am definitely a beggar. All right. Couple more rooms. Can I get into other faction? Oh, I can get into that one. Oh, what do we got? Ventilation, control board, obstructions detected, running diagnostics, the little time sign. High pressure pipes ruptured. 
Ventilator intake jammed and requires clearing. Pull lever to unlock ventilation corridor level for maintenance crew. That one. Yeah, I think we'll wait for the maintenance crew. Oh, an RCS. Can I have it? Probably not. Okay, let's go over here. I'm going to get shot by a turret because I am not looking for one. Oh, we got... You know, if I could get these headshots all the time instead of freaking out, I might be doing a better job of surviving, not dying and being cloned half the time. Warning! Oh, this one's kind of cool because it's all angled, like uh, the angle of the console, almost. Uh, forum bio material has infiltrated ship systems. AI computer core compromised. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. That's not good. Uh... Heavy mechan mechanoid deployed to deal with hostile intruders in rear hangar bay. Oh, no. Oh, that means I'm going to have to kill a heavy mechanical droid. That sucks. Security system non-responsive. Me mechanoid system. Sy mechanoid security system offline. Pull. Emergency override to reinitialize security system. Tempting. I don't. Let's wait on that because we are going to have to call it an episode here. Let's clear this level first. Um. This is kind of cool, although that's supremely bright. All right. Nothing in there. Wait a minute. Where'd you come from? There was nothing in here. Now there was something in here. What the crap? All right. That is just not fair. Oh. Can I have those? I need those for our base. Oh, is the core accessible in this place? That's what I would like to know. No, I want them all. Take them all. Okay. All right. And we are at the end of the corridor. And was there anything special through the hole here? <laughs> I'm surprised I made that without the jetpack. That would be a negative. It's just a turret in here. No stuffs! Can't open that. Hit! Hit! Alright. I got these two, right? No! No! Oh, right, because I was getting shot in the back as I was trying to get those. Right. Right, right, right. I remember things. <sighs> Sometimes. That looks cool. Ah. Uh... I got too close to the doors are locked due to ventilation due to a ventilation problem. Uh, find the ventilation control and resolve the issues. And we will. Uh, there's going to be evilness in there. And there's a turret up there. And there's a turret up there. Are there any other turrets in here that I can see? So that would be a negative. Um. And unless the door has moved, it is like actually right below these 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 blocks right here. It's right below here. Um, and then there's another oak door right below here. So those turrets are actually facing the doors. So, yeah, that sucks. All right, but uh, that this is cool. I am still really intrigued by this. I want one of these on my ship. And I am curious, did they, did they, Elyon being they, um, will this show the planet that you were in orbit of? If they did that, that would be really cool. Also, uh, in 1.9.4, I think uh, while I was messing around with um, uploading uh, blueprints and updating pictures and stuff on my workshop for the EM pillbox um, 
for the M pillbox. The M pillbox, however you want to say it. I noticed a thing that there was a new falling animation. Um, so if you fall from a high place, you don't fall, you know, like you're standing. Uh, in fact, uh, J cam, is that what it is? No, F cam. Excuse me. So you don't fall from a, like you're standing. So you have an actual falling. I don't know if it's an animated thing or if it's uh, just a, um, a different state of stance, I guess would be the words I'm looking for. Not entirely sure on that, but let's shut the if cam back off. Let's get into a spot where it has more light, like over here, which would be fabulous. Okay. This, this should work. Let's stand on this side. And let's get unarmed and take our helmet mitts off. And how's our armor doing? Terrible. Wonderful. Oh, let's get that stuff in the fridge before we go because I'm going to forget about it and it's going to spoil. There we go. And oh, we're okay on food for the moment. We could use some more oxygen, which we picked some up. There's some. Perfect. Okay. And uh, yeah. So that should do it. And then we go back into the F cam. How long has this thing existed, I wonder? <laughs> Probably for a while, and I just didn't know it. All right, folks. Oh, 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 oh that's a little close. <laughs> All right. Hey, before I let you go, I, uh, this episode, and more especially the last episode, they, they've been a bit discombobulated because, well, I have made notes um, and uh, wrote stuff down of what I wanted to accomplish in e each episode. And Well, this one was pretty easy. Don't die. Um, but then I sidetracked anyway because I'm, well, I sidetrack a lot. I, I can't help myself. I get curious about something or I see something, you know, squirrel. <laughs> That's me, in a nutshell. Squirrel! Uh, uh. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, I got sidetracked again. Um, but yeah, it, it, these things happen. I know it upsets some people, and some people may find it funny. Find the humor in it. That's all I'm saying. But anyway, so I apologize for getting sidetracked so much and being a little discombobulated during these episodes, but it's hard to concentrate on a game, concentrate on a recording, concentrating on having some kind of coherent speech and expressing what I'm thinking while I'm doing the other two things of recording, which I am constantly observing and making sure I'm doing the things correctly, and playing a game, which I'm also trying to concentrate on and not die in the process. And so it's it's a it's a it's a it's a process. Let's just put it that way. It's a process and I uh, I thank you for putting up with it. And uh, one last thing I will say to you before I let you go and enjoy the rest of whatever day, evening, night, winter, summer, fall, spring. <laughs> Those were out of order. That's fine. Uh, take care of you and yours. And please be safe out there, folks. Have a good one. We'll see you next time. <laughs>